Mum, may I talk to you please? Of course you may, as you asked me nicely. What did you want to say? I owe you an apology for the way I spoke to you earlier. I honestly don't know what came over me behaving like that. I accept your apology, sweetheart. Roscoe. Just the boy I wanted to see. I've been looking for you too. Before we go any further, I must say I'm deeply sorry for bursting in on you using the toilet and speaking back to you sarcastically instead of leaving you alone like you told me. I've already forgiven you for that. You're my little sister. I love you, and I could never hold a grudge against you. And mum, I insist that I serve my grounding. I truly deserve it. I'm lifting your grounding and giving you a second chance. You deserve it even more. It was very grown up of you to decide that. I thought that, given the fact I'm nearly nine, it's time I grew up and started being good from now on. Lily, you are already showing how mature you can be. I'm proud to call you my baby sister. I love you Roscoe. You're the best brother a girl could ask for. Don't just stand there, Romana. Join us. Welcome to the world, mature Lily. Romana, I love you, but my mature side just took a long while to show itself completely. Lily. Word of mouth is you've outgrown your switches between good and bad behavior, in favor of being good from now on. That is absolutely true, Nan. I think somebody is tired. Come on Lily. Let's go and put you to bed.